Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to disable the automatic maintenance task as well as the task schedule or privacy settings in your Windows 10 computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial here. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing I would suggest doing would be to open up the start menu. and type in notepad. One of the best managers should come back with notepad here. I'm going to left click on that. Now I'm going to have a link in the description of my video to a pastebin file to an online site that's going to be hosting the text of this in the description of the video. Shouldn't be any ads or surveys attached to that link. I just cannot put this in the description of the video. There's just too much in here and there's too many characters that probably I would not be able to actually put in the description of my video. I know YouTube is kind of weird about angle brackets in the description. So anyway, once you've copied it into a notepad file like you see here, you want to go and left click on the file tab at the top left corner of the notepad file. Left click on save as. For file name, you can name this whatever you want. I probably would say just calling it task and mint and that's but it could be whatever you want and then you want to add a dot .bat on the end and save as type, click inside this drop down and select all files. I would suggest saving this to a convenient location on your computer such as your desktop so we can easily retrieve it. Left click on save. Once it's done, close out of this notepad file. You want to go ahead and right click on this file. Left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, left click on yes. And once it's done, there you go. That's it. So pretty straightforward process. Delete the file if you choose to do so. And that's about it. So as always, thank you for watching. Do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.